Up for a little run this morning in the big town of Skycomish. Very large. I think we covered it all of about a mile. Past maybe two cars. And a school bus. Getting ready for school. And getting ready for another day of hiking and on the road around Washington. today on a little recovery hike to Deception State Park territory on a little island and uh, named as such because uh, it deceived the first explorers to this region thinking that they were on the mainland when in reality they weren't and uh, hence the Deception Bridge that was built to connect this island with the mainland. One of the most beautiful places we've been to. The water is so beautiful, it's so peaceful, calm, and it's just everywhere you turn is a pic picturesque. Right, we've been waiting for how long? Two, Two hours. hours. Two and a half hours, Two and a half hours Two and a half on standby. Hours. We watched one ferry come and go, but we get to board this one Over at there, Mike. Over 7 30. Hikes have been really amazing, but they've taught us something, Dawn. We can't keep up with those, those young kids anymore. Uh, At least I can. We can't. Wait, let's just acknowledge we can't keep up and enjoy the ride. It's been beautiful.
getting an early start this morning on our way to Rialto Beach. It's about an hour and 20 minute drive from where we're staying in Port Angeles. We're heading out to the Pacific Ocean today. We're going to see the coast. And what else? Hopefully some otters. Otters. Orcas. Orcas. Sea anemones. Yes. And starfish. And we're trying to make it before high tide because there's a hike we'd like to do down by the, the water side. That's only accessible in low tide. It's called Hole in the Wall. Hole in the Wall. And do you know how high the tide, or the differential between low and high tide? It's over eight feet. So we don't want to swim back and don't want to do a rock climb up the cliff. So we're going to see what we're in for today. Despite our early start, we got one of the last parking spots in the parking lot and we're experiencing some of the beautiful Pacific Coast weather this morning with a heavy cloud and mist over the whole area. Stay in Port Angeles started with a foggy trip to the coast this morning to see a hole in the wall. We went out to Rialto Beach and walked about a mile or so and found these beautiful rock formations jutting out into the ocean. Did a couple of short hikes uh, this afternoon uh, seeing waterfalls. Had a lovely 
accommodations while we were here in Port Angeles with a spacious house and uh, even a kitchen. The trip over here to the Olympic Peninsula was a success with a lot of different varieties of water that we saw the lake today, the, the ocean and the, the ferry on the way over here. It's been a good trip out to the Pacific Northwest. Even though we didn't get to the rainforest, we got glimpses of the rainforest with all of the moss-covered trees and the gorgeous ferns and variety of green. After the early morning, returning in the car, we're on the plane, flying back to reality. What a wonderful gift our 10 days in Seattle was, filled with mountains and family memories and more places to think about exploring in the future. Oh! Oh, yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs>